Hi guys, in this video I want to show you how to draw the conventional representation of a boat. On the diagram we've got this view here, we have the top view and the boat. It's an M20 boat, meaning that the diameter of the shank from this line to this line is 20 millimeters. The head of the boat we are going to say it is equals to 0 0.7 times the diameter, which is the diameter of the shank. In our case, it's an M20 bolt, so the shank is 20 millimeters in diameter. So the height of the bolt head is 14 millimeters. Now, the width of the bolt, we are going to project it from the top view of the bolt. The top view of the boat is constructed from a circumscribed circle. This circle is a diameter of 1,5 D. So in our case, since it's an M20, our D is 20. So 1,5 times D is 30. Then we are going to draw a circumscribed hexagon with a circular diameter of 30 millimeters. We are going to draw the circle the radius of the circle is 15. Then we'll draw the hexagon. We're going to project the corners of the hexagon. Then we're going to draw the height of the bolt. The height of the bolt head from this point to this point is 0 0.7 times t, which is 14, since our t is 20. So we're going to measure 14 from this point 14 to here. then we we'll draw this is the head of the boat we're going to draw the center line of the boat now we want to draw the shank of the boat this one we are told that is an m20 so the diameter of the shank is 20 millimeters from from the center line we are going to measure 10 this is our shank we we'll draw the chamfers of the bolt. The distance from this line to this line is going to be 0 0.1 times t. So 0 0.1 times t is 2. So we're going to measure 2 from here to there. Then also from here to there is 2. This is our shank. We now want to draw this axe on the head of the board. So this is how we do it. We're going to draw a line from this corner. It is 60 degrees to touch the scene at 60 degrees. So if you are using drawing instruments, you're going to use a 60 degree set square to draw this line. Using this point where the line touches the center line, we are going to draw an arc. The radius is going to be measured from this point to this point. Then we draw an arc using this radius. We have used this point as the center. Then we draw this arc. Right. To draw these arcs, these ones, we are going to draw a center line here. We draw another line using the 60 degrees using this point as the center our center is this one then we have drawn the fillets now then we have to draw chamfers here using a 60 degree set square this is how I draw the chamfer use 60 degrees and draw a line from this point to that point the line must be tangent to this axe. Now you can finish up. So now this is the head of our board.